Hi there, it's Nancy Parker here and I'm coming at you today with a few quick exercises to help strengthen and condition your core, which helps improve your posture, support your back, um, make you look longer and leaner, and of course give you the nice toned tummy that we're all after. Uh, many of my students are always asking what's a quick, simple way, a routine for the abs, and I have to say, Mr. Joseph Bellatti's had it down. He has a series called the Fab Five, the Fabulous Five Ab Series, and I'm going to show it to you today, show you how quick and easy it can be. So here we go. All you need is a mat, and that's the most beautiful thing. You don't need any of the fancy Pilates equipment, just a cushy floor, a mat. Go ahead and lie down, and when you lie down, take a moment to just rock your pelvis forward and tuck it back, and then find the middle between those two extremes where you feel like your pelvis is level. There's a little bit of space between your low back and the floor. We call that neutral. From there, you're going to breathe in, and as you exhale, imagine you're stopping the flow midstream, so you're engaging your pelvic floor muscles, and yes, fellas, you have them too. Engaging your pelvic floor muscles like you're zipping up a tight pair of pants to hollow your belly in and create the support for your pelvis and your back so that you can bring your legs up into tabletop. And this is the start position. We're gonna nod our chin. As we exhale, slide your shoulders down and curl up and find this out curl position, which is the base position for the whole Fab Five series. We'll start with single leg stretch. So I hug one knee in as I stretch the other leg only as low as I can keep my belly pulling in. If I go too low, I might pop the belly and pop the back. So I wanna make sure that I'm able to stay true to my abs here. Otherwise, I'm just teaching myself how to have a poochy belly and I don't think that's why we're doing this. So here we go at tempo. It's Inhale, inhale, exhale, exhale. Breathe in through the nose and out through the mouth. Slight tuck of the chin so you're gazing over your toes. You're gonna to do about a set of eight and then we'll switch to double leg stretch. Both knees bend and squeeze together. Curl a little higher. Inhale, arms and legs reach. That will stay strong. Exhale, scoop the arms, bend the knees. Five times, inhale, reach. Exhale, deep in the belly. Inhale, shoulders stay down, so you have your chin so far back that you drop back into no man's land for the neck. Circle and bend. Inhale, reach. Exhale, circle and bend. From here we go into bicycle, clasping the hands to support the head. Stretch one leg out, rotate to the back knee. Breathe in for two and out for two. Stay in the curl. Don't rock on the pelvis. It stays perfectly still. Eight repetitions here, inhaling and exhaling, keeping that belly pulled in strong. Bend both knees, ready for scissors. If at any point you feel pain in your neck or your back, rest, put your head down. Or maybe you imprint your spine, pressing your low back gently into the floor. If you're still having pain, stop immediately. So scissors, we straighten the legs. Reach for the straight leg. The opposite leg pulses to the floor. This is about your hamstrings. Pulse, pulse, inhale, switch. Notice the belly wants to pooch out here, so keep pulling it in. Notice the shoulders, they want to reach up to grab the leg. Instead, pull them down and just let your leg pull towards you. You're just adding a little stretch with your hands here. Exhale, exhale, inhale, switch. No rocking of the pelvis, and don't pull in your legs so much that your belly pooches up and your tailbone curls up. Keep your tailbone on the mat. Last set, last exercise, double straight leg stretch. Once again, support the head. This time, turn your legs out, flex your feet. Curl a little higher, draw the belly in. Last exercise. Here we go, we're gonna inhale and lower the legs, exhale and lift. How low do you lower them? Only as low as you can keep your belly in. Inhale to lower, exhale to lift. <sighs> Careful not to lift the legs so high that you pooch up here, right? Or to lower them so low that your belly pooches out. Last set. <sighs> Bending the knees, and there you have it. Mr. Pilates, fabulous five series of abs. Holidays are coming, lots of food going in here. Diet does make a difference in how your abdominals look. However, strengthening your core will help support your back no matter what. So I hope you enjoyed this series. I hope you realize how quick and easy it can be to work your abdominals. And to finish with just a little counter stretch, 
Roll onto your belly, forearms on the floor. Gently inhale and just press up. You shouldn't feel any stress or pain here. Should feel like a nice stretch for your belly. If you can lift high, great. You may only lift to here. It just depends on your body and your back. Inhale, stretch and open. And exhale, relax. Ah. I hope you enjoyed that as much as I do. If you have any questions, concerns, or comments, or if you have any pain when doing that exercise, feel free to reach out and connect with me. I'd love to help. Have a beautiful day.